Hey, man. Going to New York? When? This weekend? Okay, bet. This following story is an excerpt of my artist statement for the Design Theory and Illustrations 2 class, generated by AI to create a fantastical story. These are the pictures AI generated from these words. <laughs> nice. Whoever these people are must love colors. Not particularly my taste. <laughs> hey there, I'm Jan Shabazz, a 20-year-old African-American fashion designer hailing from Bakersfield, California. But Virginia Beach, Virginia is where I call home. My journey in fashion kicked off when I was knee high, and by the ripe age of nine, I was already crafting leather goods like it was second nature. From the waves of the Pacific to the Southern charm, my designs tell tales of a life well lived. But it's not all about earthly inspirations for me. I draw from the cosmos, the otherworldly wonders that make you dream with your eyes wide open. Life with all its ups and downs has taught me that every stitch is a lesson, every fabric a chapter in my story. My creations aren't just clothes, they're experiences, snippets of the journey that shape who we are. So come join me in the cosmic dance of threads and textures. Let's tell stories, wear memories, and embrace magic woven into every stitch. Although I feel every stitch is a lesson, and each piece holds a chapter of my story, it doesn't realistically portray my life. The statement, separate from the nine-sided prism we had to create about key attributes of ourselves, told a compelling story. But it's not true to how I view my life. Now, I'll tell the story myself. This is my family. My parents fell in love in high school, providing my brother and I with a standard of love. They both grew up in different religions, which offered us the opportunity to delve into both. My dad, Muslim, and my mom, Seventh-day Adventist. Attending a Seventh-day Adventist private school from K through eighth grade required school uniforms. If I didn't wear one to school, it would be worn to church on Saturday. That uniform did not offer any room for style. I felt confined. However, when I grew to experience different cultures, I grew an appreciation for those uniforms. I was able to find a love for them again. And for the past three years, I've been subconsciously designing uniforms for each collection I create. There's a sense of beauty in knowing what's true and comfortable to you in a world of constant movement and chaos. The experiences I'm blessed to have are lessons. And each time I step into the world, it's an opportunity for me to adapt to each one and grow not only as a person, but as a designer.